Welcome to where I call home. I've been roaming these parts since I was old enough to, well, roam. There isn't a mountain or lake out here that hasn't been explored by either me or my dad. I hope that you get a chance to fall in love with Silver Ridge Peaks. If you're anything like me, it won't take long. chance to grab a big breakfast before heading out. There's a lot of ground to cover and it's tough on an empty stomach. Anyway, I'm sure you'll be glad to know that I already have a job for you. While things are quiet, I've been using our outpost to store essential supplies. There is an outpost not far from you that has a small stockpile of bottled water and canned goods. I need you to grab some things from this outpost and ferry them over to one of our observation towers. Don't worry. It's not a long journey. You'll be back to hunting in no time. Before now, we've always just used the lakes for drinking water. But ever since Dad got ill, we've had to put emergency measures in place. We always had emergency supplies, of course. But now we need to account for the possibility that our entire water table is polluted. Dad and I are convinced that it's just the one lake, polluted by the old mining sump next to it. But it's taking forever to get tests done, and it's not worth the chance of someone else getting sick. This is the place. The supplies should be laid out, ready for you to pick them up. We need at least six water bottles, a couple of cans of peaches, or whatever we've got there. And there should be a stack of flyers. Grab them, too. Got everything? Fantastic. The tower isn't too far to go from here. Fantastic. That tower should have everything it needs now. How's the view from up there? It's great to have a hunter like yourself around. I'm grateful for your help with the supplies. I can't wait to hear your Silver Ridge hunting stories. Things have been quiet here recently. But with a hunter of your caliber on the reserve, we're gonna show folks that this is still the best place in the Rockies to hunt. Plus, you're not the only one working with us. We were able to convince Remy Warren to visit, and he's been logging his solo hunts out here for a week or so. He's got a pretty decent following online. 
so hopefully he's impressed with the reserve. When I proposed using social media to promote the reserve, the board were a little hesitant. But they're giving us a chance to try something new, and I'm sure it'll be worth it.